Welcome to today's class. So for today, we'll be looking at um, white revision class on radioactivity. Um, we'll take some white pass questions and solve them together. Now, this question says, how many beta particles or particles are emitted in the radioactive decay of um, gold? So A, you there is gold. Gold 198 and 79 to give you mercury hg um 198 and 80 all right so you have your options there let's get this done please um first of all this is called a nuclide symbol we said the nuclide symbol is a symbol of an element showing its atomic number and mass number nuclide symbol for gold nuclear symbol for mercury so you're asked to find how many beta particles are being emitted now what do we know about beta particles beta particles are simply electron having atomic number of minus one and mass number of zero now we said when a particle emits beta when um when a nucleus or when an atom of an element emits beta particles the atomic number is being increased by one so if i look at this now this is 79 this is 80 obviously it has to be plus let's say this is one beta particle here now of course um but this if i look at this now if i combine this this becomes 198 plus zero that's 198 this becomes 80 plus minus one that gives you 79 so only one beta particle matches this equation so hence we can say um gold au emits just one beta particle so my answer there is one which is option a so that's how you answer this question all right so let's try another wire revision question on radioactivity this question says radium radium 226 emits two alpha particles to produce polonium po nuclide the correct formula of the nuclide is dash all right so first things first we have radium that's r a you're given this as 226 226 and 88 so i'm having 88 so this emits what there they said two alpha particles so two we said alpha particles are simply helium nuclei. So it becomes helium nuclei having atomic number 2, mass number 4, and polonium, PO. Of course, since it's a decay to have plus energy. Because we said energy is always given out during um, a radioactive decay. But I said that so. Let's see what the nuclide symbol for polonium will be. That means we need to find the atomic number and the mass number. So how do you do that? I have here as 88. Let's start with atomic number. For atomic number, this is 88 minus total atomic number here becomes 2 times 2. That becomes 2 times 2, which is equal to 88 minus 2 times 2 is 4, and that's equal to 84. So polonium will have atomic number 84. I have this. For the mass number, this becomes 226, subtract this times this, becomes 2 times 4, and that's equal to 226 minus 2 times 4 is 8. And that's equal to, if I subtract this, this gives you 218. So I'm having here as 218. So hence, the correct nuclear symbol for polonium is um atomic number 84 and mass number 218 uh, let's check which option has this 218 and 84 that's option d so your answer is option d all right so this is how we do these are few wire questions on radioactivity to watch a complete tutorial video on radioactivity simply check this video here and of course we'll also drop a link to the video in the description of this particular video so just check the description you see a link to the complete tutorial video on 
with the activity. All right then. So, see you in our next class.